Hello, how's it going today, guys? Anthony here, Anthony CBD. We're, today we're uh, gonna go over some stuff, um, some side effects of CBD oil. Uh, welcome back to the channel. If you haven't been here already, there's a couple of videos out. You know, you can learn some more about CBD oil if you're interested. Uh, we go over a lot. Welcome to the channel, and uh, today we're gonna go over the side effects of using CBD. Cannabin cannabidol oil. Okay, so we went over CBDs, one of the chemical compounds found in the hemp plant. Um, so uh, I did some research because it's really hard to find side effects of CBD oil. Um, obviously, there's a lot more benefits than there are side effects. Um, the side effects seem to be very minuscule. If anything, just like <laughs> like regular um, effects that you could get from eating like different types of food so it's it's let's just go over it um, so let's see we're on the webmd.com and cannibal is possibly safe when taken by the mouth and appropriately in adults uh, about 300 milligrams daily have been used safely for up to six months 1215 milligrams daily have been used safely for four weeks. Um, candle sprays have been used 2.5 milligrams for up to two weeks. Here are the side effects dry mouth. I mean, you, you know, you can, you can over hydrate and drink too much water and it becomes an unquenchable thirst and you slowly dehydrate your body and one of the first symptoms of that is a dry mouth <laughs> so apparently if you uh, take can at CBD you get dry mouth personally I've never experienced it low blood pressure um, I found another one it's it's very minuscule that it drops your blood pressure because I wanted to look that up so I found one uh, a case staying saying it's a very low amount. Uh, see, the thing is, though, for many people, high blood pressure, if this lowers your blood pressure, that's actually a benefit. It's a side effect. I mean, side effects don't have to be negative, do they? Just a side, extra side effect. Okay, lightheadedness. Um, lightheadedness. I guess you just feel a little, uh, a little light in your head. And then we have drowsiness. Yeah. You do feel pretty tired. I mean, it, it helps people go to sleep. I mean, I wouldn't take, you, you can take it and work out, take it and all that stuff. It's, you know, you move, you'll be fine. I've taken it and worked out. Okay. Um, pregnancy and breastfeeding. It's not enough reliable information about the, yeah. I mean, if you're pregnant, I would just stick to food and stay away from all pharmaceuticals, drugs, anything like that because it goes right to your kid. Um, I'm not giving any medical advice. I'm just reading what's off of this. Um, Parkinson's disease, some early research suggests that taking high doses of cannibal might make muscle movement and tremors worse in people with Parkinson's disease. Okay, but we've seen that it cures seizures. Uh, let's go to another here, Cute Cora. That's a great, uh, I like this site. A lot of people write some good stuff. Uh, we have uh, Katrina Strang here from the global head of DevOps and Principal Cloud Security at CBD Oaken. <sighs> there are very few uh, effects of CBD, and she says mostly minor, but you should be informed before. Okay, the first one is inhibition of hectic drug map metabolism. So basically what she's saying here is that it messes with your enzymes a little bit. But to give you an idea, CBD can be indeed interact with serious, a series of pharmaceuticals as it inhibits the activity of some liver enzymes called cytochrome P450. This family of enzyme metabolizes most of the pharmaceutical drugs used to treat humans. If one takes high doses of CBD, the cannabinoid can temporarily neutralize the active P450. 
at times. And see, I don't even think that would be bad because most people, right? Everybody's trying to get all pharmaceuticals. We all realize they're not good for us at all. So wouldn't it make sense just to not try to take the pharmaceuticals? The whole point is to get all pharmaceuticals, right? Don't, everybody wants to be healthy. That should be the goal, not take more drugs. If the doctor starts recommending more drugs, he's just taking money out of your pocket, okay? You got to trace it back to what you eat and if you're exercising. If you're just sitting around watching TV all day, there's no way you're ever going to feel good, okay? It's just going to give you anxiety, depression. You got to get outside, go for a walk. I don't care if you live in the city. You got to get outside, find a park. You just have to. You have to work out. You have to push yourself. That's what life's all about. But you have to understand it's, it's a slow change. It's little steps every day. You just stay in the moment and you come across it and you go. You have to understand your philosophy that I just make the right decision at the day. And you don't have to work out that you hate it. Just move. Just move a little bit. Say to yourself, I'm going to get warmed up. Warming up always helps. Get warmed up. Just move a little bit. Boom, boom. Shake your body. Do a couple jumping jacks. Move side to side. Move your arms up and down. Just warm up. And then you can get into a little workout. So many apps. Okay, so uh, you can temporarily neutralize the activity at port 50. Okay, so it's going to stop produce, It's going to stop the enzymes that help you break down pharmaceuticals. How is that even a, ph- a side effect? Anyway, uh, we got dry mouth again. It just makes you thirsty. Dry mouth, cotton mouth. Uh, Increased tremor, Parkinson's diseases, high doses of CBD. Oh, so basically, it's easy to start with smaller doses. Uh, low blood pressure. Went over that. Lightheadedness and drowsiness. Huh, well, here you go. Yeah, Martin says he's been taking CBD for a while now, and that friends and colleagues have never had any negative side effects. All right. I mean, that's all I could find. Hope you guys liked today's video. Um, it's kind of a quick one. If you know any other side effects or if you have any side effects while you take CBD, let me know. <sighs> Don't forget, if you need to get some CBD, go to anthonygod.myctfocbd.com. Become a free associate. It's worth it. You can order your you can order the products that will allow you to order the products and you be, get a free website. Right? You get a free website, you know, share with your friends. You make a little commission, a whole back office. It's pretty sweet. But if you just want to buy it, then you can shop as a customer. Um, let's see here. If you want to shop now, you can go to shop as a customer. Sign in. Uh, order. Place order. And, uh, you can get in here, select your country. So right now it's available in Canada, England, Scotland, Wales, North Ireland, Ireland, and Sweden. Not bad. So you can see it's starting to be legal and in different countries. So if you get it through, it's 50 bucks, usually like $100 for this one. The 300 milligram peppermint, 500 milligram peppermint oil drops. You can check all these out. Oh, there's a lot of them. You can get a bundle. What's this? Tickets. Is that tickets to the CTFO? Oh, that's pretty cool. Um, pet sprays. There's the lotions. Chew off. Healthy bite sized snacks with CBD. And... That's awesome. I uh, love the way you age. CBD Insta ankle remover. Yeah, so uh, sign up. Anthony God dot ctfo cbd dot com all right all right guys have a great day hope you enjoyed leave your comments below